In this video, we're going to have a quick look at this Brook Crompton single phase motor. It's one half kilowatts, uh, so that's approximately two horsepower. Uh, single phase, it is a capacitor start, capacitor run motor. And this is the old capacitor. There is a bit of a clue that something's gone wrong here. Look at that. Never quite seen one like that before, but that was a, a, that was a dead giveaway that there was something wrong with this. So there's the replacement. It's a 30 microfarad capacitor. And because it's got these four lugs there, that's a little bit inconvenient. I had to cover those over, so I just for the moment just slipped it inside that bottle, which I cut the end off. Probably not ideal, but it's better than nothing. Uh, apart from that, the motor runs fine now. Uh, let's just have a quick look at the data plate. 30 microfarads, 200 microfarads, so that's the two capacitors. Uh, single phase, 50 hertz and 9.5 amps full load. And it is a totally enclosed fan cooled motor. So there's a fan behind that cowl there. The motor runs fine. Uh, I think that it's a little bit noisy on the bearings. We'll have a listen in a moment. Um, it's a little bit rumbly, a little bit screechy. It does settle down after you've uh, left it running for a couple of minutes. Uh, having said that, I would have thought, bearing in mind that this is a high torque start motor, it's got a um, decent amount of power. It might be suitable for, say, a compressor, in which case, uh, if this were on a compressor, the likelihood is that the compressor is going to drown out any noise from the motor. So we just have a quick listen to it, just for a moment. I just flick it on and then off. So, like I say, not the quietest of motors, but um, might be suitable for something. Okay. Um, oh, incidentally, uh, the motor's easily reversed. It's got a very nice uh, high capacity terminal connection box there. So it's really easy to work on the wires. Um, yeah, it's just like change a couple of wires or links in there. So uh, it's very, very straightforward to uh, change the start uh, direction. Okay. Thanks for watching.